Hi guys and welcome to another video walk around of a car we've got for sale today. We're taking a look at this five door Peugeot 108. Interesting, I've just had, this is the second one I've done this morning. We, 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 a bit like buses, you wait for ages and two of them come along together. This one's white, five door, it's a really nice little car. Before we have a look at it, it's worth pointing out, but obviously we're very much open from a showroom perspective. We are still delivering a lot of cars to customers, so if you're not local to us, please still get in touch. We can do finance remotely and we can do your part exchange remotely as well. Let's get a look at the car now. And here we have the car. It's in really nice condition. Um, we're just in the process just now of doing a plate transfer for the customer that parts exchanged it. So please don't pay too much attention to the number plates. It will be on a 64 plate when it comes to delivery. I am wandering around the car. It looks great. It's a really nice little car. I think this is a slightly higher spec model to the one that I was uh, looking at a little while ago. If we take a look at the wheels, alloys, it's got, they're in pretty good condition. Tires look good as well. A little bit of insulated marks on that wheel, but nothing that you wouldn't expect from a car of this age. I guess I should add as well, this car actually was cleaned a couple of days ago, so it's not actually as clean as it would normally be when, it's, when, I put them through, when we put them through the showroom, so I apologize for that. It's got privacy glass on the back there. And taking a look inside the car, mats are fitted and the upholstery in the back is in excellent condition. And if we take a look in the front, it's great in the front as well. No undue signs of wear or tear on the driver's seat, which is where it typically would occur. The passenger seat looks good as well. And we've got mats in the front as well. Jumping into the car, I can see 62,615 miles. I've got one key here, but I can see a note that this is one of two keys. So we've got two keys for the car. If we just start the car up, um, I can, um, the boot pack is here, as is the service history of the car. So let's use that music. Um, we'll check the service history. If the car needs a service, that'll be done prior to delivery to its next keeper. Same goes for an MOT. If that's required, that will be done as well. Um, if we just quickly go through the controls of the car, I can see we've got a multifunction steering wheel here, which has got phone controls on the left and volume and in-car entertainment, con sorry, phone controls on the right and volume and in-car entertainment controls on the left-hand side. Moving across and taking a look at the in-car entertainment, we've got radio with DAB FM, Bluetooth connection and connection via USB or aux cable down there. Um, we also have a Bluetooth phone connection. And then finally, what looks like a system that syncs with your phone, but if I'm honest, I've not actually tried to do that as yet. So we'd be slightly cautious in stating that. That all looks good. Just quickly coming back to the service history of the car. It looks like it was last serviced in December 2021 at 59,000 miles. So I would suggest it's probably not quite due a service yet, uh, but depending upon when it gets sold, we will we will double check on that. This is a nice little car. If you are interested in this car, please get in touch. You can give us a call 01382 477 you can contact us through our website, totalcost.com, or via the usual social media channels. And if you've enjoyed this video, please like, please subscribe, please comment. We appreciate your feedback and thanks for watching.